Hi guys, thank you so much for watching. It's nice to see you again and welcome here if you're new. Today I'm really excited. I have another skincare video for you guys of review and try on of the Drunk Elephant TLC Framboose Glycolic Night Serum. This is what it looks like here. I have the 30 mil size. It comes in two sizes, 30 mil and 50 mils. I got the 30 just to try it to see how it reacts with my skin. Um, so this product is from the Drunk Elephant line. It's higher end skincare that's more natural and free of a lot of the nasty, irritating ingredients that can be in skincare products. Um, so it's more natural, uh, cruelty free, and more on the higher end side of skincare. If you want more skincare videos, reviews, and try-ons, please like this video and I'll gladly make more for you. And please don't forget to subscribe. I have lots of re reviews and more videos coming on my channel for you guys. Says, Refine Retexturize, a high-tech AHA BHA gel that resurfaces dull, congested skin by gently lifting away dead skin cells, dramatically improving the appearance of texture, uneven tone, five fine lines, wrinkles and pores. The results are greater clarity and luminosity practically overnight. It turns up like this. I love the packaging because it's airtight so your product doesn't get um, exposed to sun or heat or anything like that and the pump is just all you need is one pump. That's what it looks like. It's just a clear gel. It's pretty thick. It doesn't have any smell to it and I'll just apply it now. So you always want to apply your skincare that are you always want to you always want to apply your glycolic and serums with stronger ingredients on at nighttime only, not during the day. And I'll just lift my hair up so I can do it here. And I always apply it in upward motions. And I'll link underneath the steps that I did before I applied this, like my cleanser and toner and all that. And then um just in upward motions like this and my skin type is dry and sensitive and I just make sure to go on all the parts that I want um, like I have enlarged pores or like old acne scars or hyperpigmentation or fine lines because that's where I want to focus so this is what it looks like now I don't have any makeup on I just have uh, lip gloss so this is what it looks like now. And when you put it on your skin, you just wanna allow it to sink in a little bit before you apply the rest of your skincare. This is what it looks like. I allow a few minutes to let it sink in and then I continue, when, once it's totally dry, it feels kinda of tacky on the skin, like a little bit sticky. So you definitely want to apply a moisturizer after. And I find when I use products like this that have acids and are stronger treatments, I always like to use a really simple moisturizer that doesn't have any like retinols or any uh, intense ingredients in it because it's very soothing to apply after putting this on. Um, I used to go for chemical peels and they were glycolic acid uh, chemical peels too. So what the lady had told me when I used to go and get uh, peels done is when you're using an a, a glycolic acid or any kind of like exfoliating serum, you're applying sunscreen during the day because it uh, makes new skin cells, the cell turnover is quicker so you don't want to do all that hard work and then go out in the sun and everything come back. And also with glycolic acid, it can be kind of drying to the skin. So you want to make sure that you're hydrating your skin really well. Otherwise you could see some dry patches. And I've tried this product several ways. So I tried it just on its own when I first got it. Like I do my cleansing, toning, then I'd put this on and then I just go to sleep. And I wouldn't recommend that. It has kind of a sticky um, feeling if you do that and it can leave your skin quite dry but if you follow the directions and use it how you're supposed to like as a serum and then apply your a nice soothing moisturizer after you barely have any skin irritation the next day like my skin wasn't dry or irritated or red or anything and it wasn't sticky because when I put the moisturizer over top everything just sunk in together so I really do like this product I've noticed just in the few weeks like three weeks using it 
a big change in my sunspots, fine lines, and pores. Um, so I'll continue to use it and continue to update you guys. Um, if you want more skincare videos, please let me know and I'll do more for you by liking this video and subscribing. Um, and I have more videos, uh, more reviews coming for you. I'm just trying a lot of things, but I'm trying a lot of skincare and hair care and makeup and stuff to review for you guys. So just stick around for more content like that. Thank you so much and I hope you have a great day. I love this product and I'll definitely be continuing to use it. And from everything that I've tried from the Drunk Elephant line, it seems to really be nice for my sensitive dry skin. I don't get any irritation or anything. Thank you so much and I hope you have a great day. Bye.